Throw it at Tennessee. So, um, you know, we get a lot of disrespect. So we want to make it clear that we're going to come out and dominate uh, day in and day out. And, uh, you know, the work that we put in has, has shown. Uh, they, they catch countless uh, amounts of, of jugs because, uh, throughout the week. Uh, I'd probably say maybe 3,000 balls a week. Now, so um, and and that's, that's just jugs alone. That's, that's not catching with me and Joe, which we're throwing um, really well you know, three that. times a week at the least. So, of course, I guess uh, so talk about, but, uh, just continuing to gel and, and, and continuing to uh, have that chemistry um, and the work that they put in, it showed on film and it showed this past year in our season. What does it mean to score 52 against Alabama and how does that change that rivalry moving forward? I thought we were going to score a little bit more the way we started. Uh, he was uh, had a couple of mishaps, gave him a free touchdown, uh, down close in the end zone, you know, you know, had a fumble the ball, so they scored. Like, like, um, you know, know, I really just wanted, just wanted to win the ball game. That's what I'm here to do. Keep every moment the same. It might be, you know, a big game, but, you know, every game is going to approach it the same way, whether we're playing the best team in the nation or the worst team in the nation. It was also my father's birthday, so. I had to get my dad a win for his birthday. Speaking of your father, what was what? Uh, yeah, I mean, no, I have just an informal meeting. Not a formal meeting. Have you met with him in the Buccaneers yet? Uh, yes, I have. Hinden, speaking of your father, what was it like to grow up the son of the great Alan Hooker? Uh, you know, I got a lot of those those questions. He's going to be better than your father when you get older uh, from a young age. And I always told him, I'm going to be way better than my dad. But, uh, you know, we're still, we're still a very competitive family. My little brother coming up, we still have a, a quarterback competition, you know, all the time. Whenever I go back home, accuracy competitions and uh, really competitive family. My mom and sister, if they can play quarterback, they play as well. So how long did it take you to finally beat him? Uh, it didn't take too long. Uh, I, threw, I threw six touchdowns. We, we go by touchdowns. So how many touchdowns you throw in the game? I threw six touchdowns my junior year and um, ran one that game. So seven touchdowns. My brother threw seven and ran one one game. So now he holds the record. Now he has to beat my record in college, which is which is five. Uh, so yeah. How important was that Alabama win to you and your team, your program? Yeah, it was huge. You know, for not just just us, but uh, for the community, for Knoxville, for Vol Nation, uh, just to let everybody know that we're back and uh, back and better than, than ever. So um, I'm looking forward to seeing what they do this year coming up with, with Joe at the at the room, and um, I think got some, some pieces on the side. Yeah, um, myself, I had to slow myself down a little bit, but, um, you know, Doc is, is telling me, you know, he's uh, he's very proud of how hard I've worked to get my quad strength yeah, and, and quad growth back to, uh, um, you know, where it is now, really um, especially from, from where it started. I went from, you know, being on crushes for six weeks to, you know, walking the, the next week that I got off my crushes uh, to being able to do, you know, one leg, sit the stands. So, uh um, you know, I'm excited to, to really uh, get back to putting like, a lot of uh, weight on my lower body. Um, I'm really top hip right now, like so when I can finally put that weight back on my lower body, I can get to where I want to be weight-wise, especially today I was 219. That's usually my, my regular weight um, if I wasn't working out or, or doing anything crazy. So. Yeah, I met with him already. Uh, he yeah, was PA plus E was GP. Players, yeah, 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 of course, of course. I mean, if you're a football mind, you see some, something working, you're going to you know, immediately click like, hey, how do you do this? So, um, you know, everybody's just intrigued on how we run our offense. Um, and and it's, it's a cool thing. If you ever are in our offense, um, uh, then you're going to mess I tell them, you know, I tell them, you know, how we, how we do certain things. Um, and, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's effective uh, in what we do. Could it translate to the to the NFL? Some of it can. So, um, yeah. Did again. Super excited. Super excited. Um, that's my right hand man. So, uh, we talked about that moment, you know, for a very long time, uh, from 2021 when he was a starter. You know, I communicated to him, hey, it doesn't matter who's in there. Let's just make sure we win ball games. And um, that's how we you know, just became such close friends and uh, such great competitors as well. Day in and day out, me and Joe push each other to be better.